Wow, <laughs> I cannot believe this day came so fast. The iPhone 10 is now discontinued and obsolete. <laughs> That's how fast this happened. I'm still reeling off from that. But as you guys know, today is, is the day. It's National iPhone Release Day. And the 10s and the 10s Max is finally out in stores. And there's probably tons of people out there already in all lower place, just different areas of the world. Um, and they're just like rushing into Apple stores, you know, getting their new iPhones. And it's just a magical time for Apple fans. And uh, it really shows that there's value in Apple products and people like Apple products. And um, I'm, 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 really, I'm really excited today. Now there's not an Apple store in our city because we live in a small populated town. Um, not too small, but small enough for Apple to not invest in it. <laughs> and so we don't have an Apple store. Our, our nearest Apple store is actually pretty far away, but we do have a Best Buy and the Best Buy has a really nice Apple section. It feels like the Apple store and they're going to have the phones and they're going to have the Apple Watch Series 4 for us to demo and get a hands-on experience. Hopefully there's not too many people out there. I'm pretty sure it's, it's packed because of the new release, but hopefully there's not too many people. We can get a good demo, we can get a good hands-on experience, get some good footage, and um, I get a good feel of what the 10s Max and the Series 4 is like. I didn't pre-order it because I wanted to get a hands-on experience first. I always like to feel what it's like, get a real like in-person experience. Yeah, I know there's reviews online already of the 10s and 10s Max, but I would rather get a personal hands-on experience of that and the Series 4 and I would also like to add my video to the collection of the YouTube videos online of the hands-on experiences for the record. And I'm excited for this day. I, it's, it's crazy. I mean, I have, I have my iPhone 10 box here. And for all year, it was the newest device. I had the latest device. And now this is even obsolete and discontinued. Like, <laughs> so, yeah. So we're going to go to the stores. We're going to check it out. Get a hands-on demo. And I'm going to do a overview once I get back. Um, we're going to talk about what I liked, what I didn't like, kind of like my, my summary of my experience. So cannot wait to take you guys with me and <sighs> let's go to Best Buy. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. The iPhones are out. Like the 10s, the 10s Max oh, is literally in the stores right out. now. I'm going to check them out. <laughs> Dude, I swear, like, it's it's literally, like, they just came out today. Well, I guess I'll be stopping at the Apple store as well. Yeah, you have a, you, you guys are going to have an Apple store in a way. I'm going to head to Best Buy because they have them on, on display right now. In Best Buy? Yeah. They have them basically anywhere they sell iPhones. I, I'm assuming maybe, like, Targets and Walmarts have them, but I like to have the hands-on demo. I'm going to wait till everything Apple Pro says... Guys, if you don't have this phone, I suggest get it. You gonna listen to everything? Up? You can listen to Philip, bro. <laughs> Dude, whatever Philip says, I'm gonna probably. Do. No, but like, no, bro. You gotta, you gotta get the phone that's right for you. He, I mean, all he can do is recommend, but like. I mean, this phone is nice for me. It really is. There's nothing wrong with the 10. It's just like there's no. so much hype over the 10s Max. I want the Max because I want the bigger size, but like, Same. that's the only, more. that's the only thing that, and the gold, like. And you know the Apple Watch Series 4 is out too. Yeah, but see, see, like, I barely use this one. You, oh, bro. You're killing me, man. I, mean, I love the freaking walkie-talkie thing. That's freaking cool. That's next level, right? It's like Inspector Gadget type stuff. And <laughs> I'm going to be freaking out in the stores, man. I don't want to have to do that. I want to just go there, get some good footage, demo it, and then come back do my summary, like a really detailed informational video, but like my fanboy is going to kick in and <laughs> I can tell it's, it's, yeah. Oh, oh my God, there we go. Oh bro. I don't know if my Mac can even do that. <laughs> Monkey, what do you think about the Apple release? All right, bro. Well, I'm going to go get dressed, and I'm headed to the store. You guys be safe, and uh, let me know what you think about the iPhones when you see them.
That means I'm going to the store uh, on my own, which is fine. I'm okay with that. I am perfectly fine with doing that. Um, that was my buddy Leo. He helps me sometimes with like getting angles with like cameras and filming. But he's going to be going out of town in a couple of minutes, which means it's going to be me solo. And I don't mind that. Alright guys, so I am actually at my school right now. I just got out of class and uh, I had to come here first. You know, you gotta put education first. Um, and now we're gonna head over to the store, we're gonna check out what the phone looks like. Really, really excited. Like, I have butterflies in my stomach. I'm just so excited for this. I really can't even imagine like the frame of the 8 Plus with the screen of the 10. So I am very excited to see what it's like. Let's go do it. All right, guys, so we are on our way to Best Buy right now to the Apple section. Um, I did call them in advance, and they did tell me they have the uh, phones on display. Of course, I knew that they would, but it's just I had to clarify because you never know. Um, and so sorry if I look like I have spots on my shirt and I'm wet or sweating. It's not sweat. It's rain. Uh, I walked out of class today, and it just decided to start pouring down raining. <laughs> and I mean, like, pouring raining, like cats, dogs, frogs, leopards, all the above. And now it's clean, you know, the sky is clear and it's not raining, the birds are chirping, the sun is out, <laughs> like nothing happened. That's how it is over here. But anyway, I'm not gonna let the weather rain on our parade. I'm really excited to see the 10S Max in person. I'm gonna dry off for a little while. We're gonna head over there and uh, we'll get some hands-on experience. <laughs> We're going, we're going in, we're going in. Oh my God, I'm so excited, so excited. This is so cool. Next year, what I wanna do though, I wanna like go to an Apple store and just see what it's like to camp out and actually stay the night. You know, like to get that experience. You got so many people who do that. They stay in the line and then they camp out until the release of the next day. Like people were camping out since like yesterday evening for this stuff um to be the first ones to get it i would like to just have the experience just know what it's like to do that i bet it's so cool and so exciting like you're anticipating the iphone and you're right in front of the apple store and then they open the doors and they're all cheering and clapping like i bet that is like so fun so anyway but in the meantime for this year i'm gonna go inside of best buy and just check it out see what it's like um, I know I'm going to love it. I'm going to want to buy it. Um, <laughs> I just can predict that right away. But anyway, nonetheless, let's go get some hands on, guys. Looking down at that phone. Guys, we are here inside of the store. And um, oh my gosh, I see the planogram. I see the advertisement for it. This is the Apple section. You can see the Apple Watch Series 4 planogram. You got the the modulars here, complications here. You got that one. That was the first one that was actually like um, advertised. And then you got the uh, I think that's the vapor. That's the vapor watch face. Pretty cool. The two sport bands, and then they have the um, woven nylon. That's cool. <laughs> I don't think I can do it. I'm freaking out. Oh my gosh. <sighs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Here it is. The iPhone 10s, literally the iPhone 10, <laughs> reincarnated. Love it. You guys sold some today? Yeah, no, we had a huge crowd. Uh, the store before we even opened. Oh, y'all did. So y'all kind of got the Apple Store experience, like <laughs> where the when they were sleeping out. No, probably not when we like, camped out, but there was a good bit of people. Sweet. Oh, this is the one. <laughs> I didn't see the back yet. 
here it is guys the iPhone 10s max holy whoa look at this it's those first like three aisles there this is a really nice phone yeah look at the uh, the trim and look at the stainless steel enclosure they finally got the gold right in my opinion right in the watch too the yeah the series 4 okay so the 44 we don't have the, the stainless out the stainless are in the glass but that's that gold stainless. but this is the size of the 44 oh wow That is super cool. I like how the vapor is like, is the full screen. Cause on the series one and two, or the series three even, it's uh, it's like just a little circle inside of the face. So that's cool. I want to try the digital crown haptic feedback. Press it in here and just go ahead and scroll it. Oh, that is so cool. That is, that is neat. Oh wow, dude, that, that's a nice gold. And it matches perfectly with the gold finish of the phone. Wow. Of course we're waiting on the uh, 10R as well. And the 10R in October, yeah. I wanna see that one though, when that one comes out. I wanna see that 10R like, I want to see the screen. I don't know if you've seen a lot of the controversy over the... Yeah, uh, yeah, over the pixels per inch and everything. Everybody's like all hot and bothered because of <laughs> because of the pixels per inch. But in all honesty, I mean, dude, it's a budget model. I'm really glad what they did with the, uh, the digital crown and the red signifying the state. I'm sorry, the uh, cellular. Mm-hmm. They really... And you do have the, the, the connection point for the new ECG monitor. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's true. But I like that it's just a red ring instead of a... A full red, red yeah. <laughs> like, it's just so much more subtle. Much more subtle. Look at the difference. Oh, wow. I know you'll never see it, but I like the way the heart rate sensor looks to you. <laughs> yeah. It's, like, much more futuristic and, like... Oh, that's such a nitpicky point. You'll never physically see it, but I think it's cool looking. I like how they added the ECG. Like, that's huge. Now, that 10S Max, that's going to be the only noticeable upgrade right there. I didn't really think it, there was going to be a phone that would make me consider not using my 10. Hey, what's up? I'm here. You're here. How's that review going? It is going pretty well. Oh my gosh, that is, that is everything. I'm setting the wallpaper. They didn't even have it set. That's hilarious. <laughs> That's the 10S Max. What do you think? Try it out. So this is the standard size of the iPhone 10 and that's 10S Max, 6.5 inch OLED. What do you think? I think that it's a little big for my pocket. Too big for your pocket? <laughs> Too big for my pocket. It's a big phone. It's a big phone, yes. It's about the same as getting a plus size phone, except it's all display. Of course you got the iPhone 10 right there. Which is amazing because I I, I thought it was discontinued, but they still have some in store, so I guess they're gonna sell until until they're all expired out. Uh, yeah, they are. It's 5.8 inch OLED for both of them. Uh, the only thing you got is the processor change. Um, you got the A12 Bionic on that one. Yep. But this guy, this is the 10S Max right here. The big one. This is the one.